What's going on, guys? You know, you know, here back again with another video. Today, we are reading some more Blue Lock and we're on Chapter 109 Battle Group. Let's hop into it. I'm not even going to waste time. Let's just do it. I did it. I was chosen. Me. I'm one of Blue Lock's 11. Oh, Boro is pissed. Igor, I don't know why you're surprised. Rayo, I can see why he's surprised. Damn it. Question Ego sign. Why isn't Shido's son part of the team? He scored plenty of goals and he's ranked as number two, right? Yeah, good question. Uh, Ryusa Shido is an average of two, gosh, how scored an average of two goals per game during tryout and displaying an ability as a striker that's second to only Reni Toshi. His behavior off the field is unpardoned, but regardless of no denying the reality of his personal abilities and cap uh, capacity of score, but his goals were all brought out by his individual skills. In other words, during the tryouts, Rayo Shido was never once able to produce a chemical reaction with Rini Toshi. No chemical reaction. That makes sense. In his violence at the end of the selection, if he pulls something like that in a U-20 game, he would instantly be hit with a red card and give us an overwhelming disadvantage. For those reasons, I decided that Rini Toshi and uh, Ryusei Shido must never share the same field. That's true. And I feel satisfied seeing that. Uh, I feel satisfied seeing who got chosen. And all above, none of you can handle the egotist known as Ri, uh, Ryusei Shido. As I said, all the Shido goals were formed from individual, individual plays. Someone who can grasp his thinking and work to lift up his plays to a higher level doesn't exist in Blue Lock. He's saying, no, okay. Doesn't exist in Blue Lock. So he's most likely going to be in U20. I don't think there's anyone like that in the whole country, but it would not be a waste to use his abilities. Right. So when this team encounters the dilemma, Ryu Shido's would swap in for Reni Toshi as a joker. As a powerful interjection that could instantly change the flow of the game, I would switch him for Itoshi in the case of a dire situation. I see. That was my intent. But just after I decided on this lineup, I received a phone call. What did I say? It was President Bas uh, 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 God, Barasu, uh, Barasuta of the JFU. He said that Seitoshi was dissatisfied with the forwards on the Japanese U-20 team. And <laughs> oh, Ren. <laughs> if, he, uh, if we didn't submit to Seitoshi's conditions, then he threatened to call off the game since nobody would watch. And thereby co-signing Blue Lock to utter oblivion. There was just one condition that Sei Itoshi could take any player he wanted from Blue Lock and add them to the U20 team. Why they got him locked up like this? Three hours earlier, Ryo Shido. Let me out, you damn four eyes. I don't want to hit anybody else. I won't hit anybody else. Are you listening? I'll kill you. Fuck, fuckers, fuckness. <laughs> Yo, Devil Cunt, who the hell are you? This cage is too small for you, right? Huh? I'll set you free. I want your ego. Go berserk for me. Ooh, nah, nah, nah. This is, this is, this is evil work right here. This is evil work. Say Chosi didn't choose any of you here. He chose Reusei Shido. Oh, nah, Rin is pissed. For real? Then Shido will fight you as a Japanese U-20 representative. Well, in any case, whether it was Reni Toshi's team or Ray Oshido's team, I only had two choices for Blue uh, for Team Blue Lock. Compared to Reni Toshi's individual skills, which incorporated his surroundings and produced synergy, Ray Oshido's makes no attempt to coordinate with anyone. He is self he's a self-sufficient player with uh, two players with the similar uh, similar individual skills, but completely different varieties of egotism. I chose Reni Toshi, and Shay Toshi chose our. Uh, Ryusei Shido, which was the correct choice. <coughs> oh, excuse me. That answer will be revealed 15 days from now in front of the entire country. And we're able to register 23 players on our roster. I've yet to decide on the 12 9 starting. So those, are, uh, so those of you who weren't chosen will make a case for yourselves to seize those spots. This concludes the lineup announcement. Uh, there were some surprises, uh, but now the stage is set. Losing this match means the ends of Blue Lock. 
and as well as the end of your soccer careers. Only 15 days remaining. During that time, I will administer training forge you into a, gosh, I will administer training to forge you into a battle group that was able to pulverize U20's team and seize victory. Put everything on the line, you lumps of talent. Failure is not permitted in the days to come. Hmm. That tempered four eyes. To me, this match is just a checkpoint on my way to becoming the world's best. Oh, totally. We've been gambling our lives ever since we showed up here. For real. I'm not going to wuss out now. I'm getting stoked. I suppose I'm excited. Yep. I'm going to get to it. Yeah. I, I got I, all of us. Being chosen for the starting lineup isn't my final goal. That's the ego I want to see. Uh, I want to see Blue Lock Eleven. Your final training camp is about to begin. Are you? All right, gosh. Uh, I, all of us, are going to win this and advance to the world stage. That was a banger chapter. That was a banger chapter. Let's hop into the next one. If you guys want to see that, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell notification. That way you'll know when it's out. If you like the video, give it a like. If not, give it a dislike. It doesn't really matter to me. If you want to see more of me, catch me out on Twitter. If you know, you know. And until then, you know where to find you now.